Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Taurus. This is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for August. Yes, I already did one, but I decided to do it over because I didn't like it. So, so uh, we are just going to start that over. Um, so anyway, I decided to do it over. If you guys got to see it, well, then it was probably meant for you. So if you didn't, then it probably wasn't. So anyhow, we're just going to see what comes up for August for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What do we have for Taurus? One more card, please. What do we have for Taurus for August at any time? Ooh, okay. Dark woman. Dealings or relationship with a woman with dark complexion or hair. So you're going to be dealing with a dark woman this month. Cat. A two-faced friend. This may be a friend of yours. Or not. <laughs> Success. Success is on your side. So there is some sort of success here. You do have a two-faced friend that you need to be aware of. So that's nice. Um, you're succeeding at something. You are. What do we have for Taurus? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for August. Capricorn. You may be dealing with a Capricorn. Your prayers have been heard, Taurus. Your prayers have been heard. May have something to do with this Capricorn or this woman. I don't know who that would be, but I don't know. I feel like that woman's a two-faced friend, though. Anyhow, um, your prayers have been heard in some way overcoming Capricorn overcomes maybe you're overcoming something oh we have a missed opportunity here somebody has missed an opportunity maybe you've missed an opportunity with a Capricorn and this Capricorn is something somebody is is connecting with a Capricorn boxing gloves Get out your boxing gloves or put them away. One more card fell out. Wish granted. This is what you wished for. This is what you asked for. So some sort of wish is being granted. I know that Capricorn had this recently. I'm not sure when, but I know that they had it. Anyhow, uh, boxing gloves, putting up a fight. Get ready. Get ready. Some There's a competition ahead of some sort. Boxing is typically a competition. Um, there is a wish that is being granted. There's going to be success. Interesting. What do we have for Taurus? Sun, Moon, this card's like falling over. Oh, shared values. It was falling off the deck. You're, you are going to be connecting with somebody or partnering up with somebody that you have shared values with. This is somebody that obviously you have a lot in common with. And there's going to be success, but you gotta, you do got a two-faced friend here. You may not need to, maybe you don't listen to their advice. Maybe you, maybe you shouldn't listen to their advice. I don't know. Um... We got for Taurus. Breathe, breathe. The breath is a vital, is the vital bridge between your body and soul. It's the connection between the inside and outside connecting you to the universe, spirit, and the divine source. The breath permeates your entire being with prana which is the same life-giving force that nourishes everything in the universe. Interesting. You know, there may also be a need for forgiveness here. So somebody may need forgiveness. You may need to forgive somebody. You may need to. 
Holding on to resentment and anger is preventing or even suffocating your spiritual growth. Resentment is one of the strongest and most damaging of human emotions. The act of forgiveness in its own right is equally incredibly powerful. And it has the capacity to heal and transform. So there's something going on here. There is something going on here. You probably will need to forgive. Um, somebody has missed an opportunity. And I feel like whoever this person is, whether it's you, maybe you've missed an opportunity because you were... Um, fighting for something else I'm not sure uh, there's some but there's a missed opportunity here that is probably coming back around to be re-examined to put it that way because there's some sort of forgiveness that is needed all right so there's some sort of forgiveness let's get one of these success is here though Success is in the air, so there's some sort of success, successful outcome. What do we have for Taurus? Ooh, past life relationship. You have known each other before. So we got a wish granted. We got a past life relationship here. Somebody's going to put up a fight because of those boxing gloves. There could be an ex here even with this dark woman that's putting up a fight. Somebody is putting up a fight. Hmm, interesting. All right, what do we have for Taurus? What do we have for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Knight of Cups, an offer of love. We do have an offer of somebody's looking for love. They're looking for a relationship. This is somebody that is very sensitive. I feel like there is something intense that is about to happen. Intense feelings, intense emotions, a proposal or something. King of Wands in reverse. You know, I don't know what. Who, yeah. This is an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. The King of Wands in reverse. Um, typically self-centered, uh, self-righteous, unreasonable, uh, not taking any action. Two of Swords. We got somebody here that is torn. They are torn in two different directions. They also could be held back by fear. These both of these cards, the King of Wands in reverse and the Two of Swords held back by fear, some sort of mental turmoil, struggling with a choice. We have somebody here that is struggling with a choice. They are torn in two different directions. But we have, we also, whoever this person is, they are, maybe they lack confidence. They lack confidence. I don't know. The, the King, I got another, get, get another card to that King of Wands reversed. Torn, 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 torn in two different directions. Ten of Swords next to that King of Wands, suffering. We have somebody here that is really, really, really suffering. They are in feeling defeated, you know. This is somebody that is, is, is experiencing a lot of struggles in their life right now. There is somebody here that may have reached rock bottom, you know. This is extremely you know painful this is too much overwhelming uh suffering we got somebody here that is experiencing a lot of uh pain we got somebody here that is in a lot of pain or they're struggling really 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 bad with this ten of swords this is like a breakdown mental breakdown we may have somebody here that is going through some sort of make breakdown um mm. Chariot. Chariot is moving. It is moving next to the Two of Swords. Chariot is getting in the driver's seat, taking a journey, going in a new direction, mastering emotions, finding the discipline to take control. Somebody is finding the discipline to take control, to take the lead. 
They're going to be moving in a new direction. A decision is being made right now. Ten of Wands. Uh, Ten of Wands is extremely overwhelmed. Definitely a breakdown. Physical or mental collapse. Letting something go. Somebody has been holding on to something that has been weighing them down. They've been trying to prove, you know, that, that they can handle it all. But this is it's time to relax. It's time to let go. We have somebody here that has built up their success, right? They've they've built it up and it's and it's been really hard to keep it going. Really hard, but they have. But I think we've reached a point where it's time to let go of some responsibilities or let go of some some baggage or burden because it's, it's it's affecting the health. We may have somebody here whose health is being affected by their uh, trying to do too much or something like that. Um, but there is going to be some movement with the chariot card. The thing, so there's going to be a change. We have somebody here that is going to be uh, tra taking a journey. They're, they're, they are. They're taking a journey. They're going someplace. They're making a decision to go, to get in the car, or pack up their things, or focus on the future. Somebody is going to be letting go of something that has been weighing them down and focusing face forward. It's like, I'm, I'm moving forward. So I'm moving forward. I'm making a decision to move forward. Whether it's you or this other person here, we got somebody here that is definitely, they've been struggling with a choice. They've been really suffering um and maybe they they've been uh angry even with all of the challenges that life has thrown them um but trying to prove that they can handle it all and this is just a breaking point it feels like we have a breaking point here anyhow um two of swords making a painful stressful decision to move forward move on so I don't know if you're making that decision or they are, but somebody is letting go, letting go of this. I can't, I can't carry it. I can't, I can't, I can't do this anymore. Page of Swords, a message is coming. We got somebody here that is watching. They are very, very curious. They're interested. They uh, you're going to be receiving a message that maybe surprises you. We have eight of swords, eight of swords on the bottom. This is somebody that is in a place of mental turmoil. They've been re they've been restricting themselves. They've been confining themselves. They've been. Uh, choosing to play it safe, staying put in a situation that is safe but it's not comfortable. You know, they've been letting fear hold them back. They, they've been able to escape and remove themselves from the situation but they've chosen not to. But I feel like there's, there's going to be some sort of movement with that chariot card. Page of Swords, this is somebody that a message is coming. There's going to be some conflict. There's going to be a conflict. There's going to, you're going to receive a message. It's an unexpected message. It has to do with, with, uh, what does it have to do with? What is this message? Three of Swords reversed. Something about forgiveness. Somebody may want forgiveness. They may want to be forgiven. Maybe they've been hurt really, 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 really badly. They've been heartbroken. They've been stabbed in the heart. They, there's some sort of betrayal here. Somebody has been playing it safe. There's some sort of heartbreak here. Suffering, extreme suffering with that Ten of Swords. Somebody has been suffering. They are heartbroken. They want forgiveness. They want to heal. They want to move forward now. They've been torn in two different directions. They may have been in denial or they held back by fear. You're going to be receiving a message that puts you on the spot where you may have to make a decision. Maybe you have to make a choice between two options. There could also be a troublemaker here that is, is saying something 
that causes some sort of change with the Page of Swords and this, you know, two-faced friend you got up here. You know, I feel like there there is somebody here that may uh, cause a conflict for you and whoever this person is, and and it really moves things forward you know sometimes it's like a catalyst a catalyst for change okay so you know there could be there could be a catalyst here and it's interesting that i said catalyst because we got cat here the two-faced friend i just after i said it i realized that so you may there could be a catalyst here you know whatever it is that is uh, helping it's like the universe is using them to move things forward okay Ten of Cups on the bottom. So Ten of Cups on the bottom is happily ever after, right? It's a happy relationship. It's a spiritual blessing. It is uh, the ultimate dream, right? It's wish, it's wish fulfillment. Moving towards happiness. Deepening a bond with somebody. Past life relationship. You have a past life relationship here. This is exactly what you asked for. A wish is being granted. A wish is being granted. You're going to have to make a choice. You are probably between two people. And maybe it's because this person neglected you and you chose another option. Choosing to move forward, getting in the driver's seat, going someplace, letting go of some responsibilities, letting go, making a conscious change. We got somebody here that is making a conscious change. You're going to be receiving some a message or some information from somebody. I feel like they want forgiveness. With that three of swords reversed, that's leaving the past hurts behind forgiving, healing. There's a healing. I mean, Three of Swords Reverse is healing from heartache, healing from pain. There's definitely somebody here that is suffering. They are in a lot of pain. And they've, they've really been brought to their knees. And they need healing. Three of Cups reverse. That's celebration. That's a reunion. It feels like we have some sort of reunion here. You're gonna there's there's some sort of celebration, upcoming celebrations. This is happiness. Getting together, having fun, dating. Some of you, if you're single, you may be dating. You may be you could be dating. Choosing to move forward. Some of you may be choosing to date. You're choosing to date. You you know. Two of Swords, painful, stressful decision, needing to choose, torn, torn in two different directions. Do you, do you uh, continue to suffer with somebody that isn't taking any action or somebody that is trying to control or somebody that's hurting you or whatever the case or has hurt you in the past, do you forgive them? What? This is a painful, stressful choice right here. Hmm. You may have to let go of your baggage of the past. You may have to. You may have to. You know, you may have to drop some sort of baggage and, you know, focus on the future. Be optimistic. You know, with the page of swords, be open-minded. The world, major new beginning, ending. This is the end of a cycle. This is a completion of a cycle. Something that has been affecting your life for a very long time is coming to an end. You are about to embark on a new journey. It's right next to the chariot as well. So this is the end. This is a new era, okay? Traveling in a new direction. Some of you are moving or this has to do with moving with the chariot card. 
This could be a change of residence as well. So there could be a change in your, in your residence. Major completion of a cycle. A lesson has been learned. There's something. This is the end of an era. Congratulations. Starting, this is the end. It's the end of one chapter, the beginning of a new one. Leaving the past behind, stepping into the future. Seriously, you are definitely leaving something behind. Making a choice to focus on the future. Traveling in a new direction. Taking a journey. Some of you are traveling. You're moving. Some of you are moving. This leads to a new beginning. A very positive new beginning. Celebrating. Having fun. There's also, there's somebody here that wants to start a new journey with you. They, it feels like they've been watching you. They have been watching you. This is success. The world card and the, and the chariot. That is success. That is victory. It's victory. So you got some sort of victory. You're going to, you got some sort of victory here. Public recognition. You may be receiving some public recognition. There's some sort of success here. You're going to be receive. You could be receiving some sort of offer from somebody that, you know, really makes you happy. It ex there's some sort of expansion here. I do believe you're going to be dealing with some sort of opposition, but I feel like I feel like you're able to. I feel like you you have gained some sort of experience, enough experience to handle some sort of opposition. You're going to be you're going in a new direction. Wherever you're going, it's almost like it's party time. You know, it's party time. It's time to celebrate. It's time to celebrate your victory. I mean, the world, the chariot, the three of cups. There's, this is a victory. Congratulations. Whatever the grad, congratulations is, congratulations, you win. Wish granted. Wish granted. Past life relationship. Starting a new chapter. You are starting a new chapter of your life after you have been suffering, okay? There is some extreme suffering here. You may have been, I don't know, maybe you were with somebody who didn't see your value, you know, that abused you, that, you know, uh, tried to control you, that hurt you really bad, broke your heart. That's over. There's heartbreak here. This is the end of suffering, okay? It really is. We got the, we got the Ten of Swords, the Three of Swords reverse, and the World card. So that is the end. It's the end. It's the end. It's the end of that chapter, okay? It's time to heal. It's time to focus on the future, and your future looks bright, okay? Success is yours. I feel like you're going to be shining with this. This is like a star. I mean, it is. See the success? That is that is serious success right there. As far as love goes, you got a past life relationship with somebody that you have known before. You, the, the, the opportunity was missed before, but it's not going to be missed this time. This is exactly what you asked for. It is, it is. Right? I mean, isn't that what you asked for? Breaking free. Got that Eight of Swords again, breaking free. So you think that you have been in some sort of space where you've been trapped. Maybe it's like a prison, you know, you've been, you've been trapped and, and you're about to be broken free. I feel like you're stepping outside of that space, break, escaping. This is like making an escape.
I feel like there's help arriving as well. Somebody's coming to help you. <sighs> judgment reversed. So judgment reversed is moving on from a bad choice. You are moving on from a bad choice. And I feel like there's somebody here that maybe they are. Maybe they made a bad choice. Somebody has made a poor judgment call. Now there 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 a need to be there's a need to be held accountable. Maybe we have somebody here that's ready to be judged. They're ready. They're ready to be judged. They're ready to be held accountable for their actions. I feel as though you are unaware Judgment over the chariot that is unaware. It's a lack of awareness. You are unaware that there's, I feel like there's an arrival here. Somebody, I do, I, that the chariot is an arrival. I feel like you are unaware that victory is coming. You are unaware that a wish is about to be granted. You are unaware that that cycle of suffering is over or it's just about over, whatever it was. Get prepared for some sort of celebration with the Three of Cups. Something to celebrate is coming that is going to make you very, very happy. You could be attending a get-together, going out with somebody, and I don't know what's happening, but I think sparks are going to be flying. Letting go of some previous baggage from the past. Moving in a new direction towards victory and success. Congratulations. You, you're going to have to have faith. You're going to have to have faith. Have faith in yourself. One more card and it's over. Hmm. We get the High Priestess Reverse that just came out and the Hierophant on the bottom, which is very interesting. So there's definitely a lack of awareness here. Somebody is unaware that this is something is happening. It's, it's not predictable. It's not been predicted, okay? It's unpredictable. A secret is about to be revealed. Somebody has been watching from behind the scenes, keeping something to themselves, waiting for the right moment to reveal it. Here it comes. I feel as though there's some sort of divine guidance here. I mean, this is also your card, which is Taurus, but this is divine guidance, receiving some guidance, receiving some help from above as well. This is God. This is There's a higher power involved that is guiding you. This is, this is a direct connection to God. So I do believe that your intuition is very, very high at this time, but there's certain things that they cannot tell you because it's all part of the plan. It's part of the script. You have to ha go through experiences so that you can grow. So I feel like you have had to go through some sort of um, suffering to uh, put you in your spiritual awakening. But anyhow, I do believe that that there is something that is about to be revealed to you th that uh, you totally are unaware of. Um, you are protected. There's a higher power involved. Um, you need to believe in yourself. You need to have faith, okay? It feels like you have called in something. You are about to be go going in a new direction that brings you some sort of uh, recognition, whether it's public recognition or it's just victory, victory and success. You are definitely headed towards success. I feel like you're headed towards success with a partner that you probably have a past life connection with. 